Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial. So today we are going to solve one issue that is called error e require ESM require ES module. So whenever you are getting this issue, so what we have to do? So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. So let's get started. So this, you can uh, go check this error. That is error underscore require ESM. That means this module that you are installing that one that is npm i am using the chalk or something and that will work in form of the import where we have the es module that means the current version of es6 or es8 whatever so that will work on that one right not this one so there is an issue with the version so you need to check which version will compatible with your one okay so currently you can see that I have just uh, used this npm i chalk 5.0.0 so you can see that it's installed but the error is the const require chalk is not there right again the error is require es module i have just switched to the new version npm i chalk 2.3.2 and you can see that <coughs> run after running this you can see that node index.js there is no error that means whenever you have such kind of issues right so you can see here by default, if you are adding this one, right? Uh, if I go and just check npm chalk over here. Okay, so if I go and check this one. And by default, it works with the ES6 module. You can you can see that here documentation is also written over here. Okay, Ch chalks comes with an easy composable API. We can change the NIST style. So you can see chalk 5 is ESM, okay? And if you want to use chalk with a TypeScript or a build tool, you will probably want to use the chalk 4 for now. Okay. So previous mod previous versions that will work with the this part, right? If you are using this kind of things, so you need to change the module version that will work accordingly. So this is the reason of that one. So any doubt, any query in that, just let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.